How was your day, son? It was good, mom. My teacher refused to collect my assignment today. She said because I have not paid my school fees, she will not give any assessment to me. That's nonsense. I know we have not paid your fees, but that's not why she shouldn't collect your assignment. I know, mom. I wanted to get angry, but I remembered she had given me so much grace, more than she gave any other student before. I know, but that's still not why she should not collect your assignment. You know what, my son? What, mom? Today, you and your sister will be leaving that school. God has changed our story today. Any best school of your choice, that's where I will put you. Same with your sister. Really, mom? Are you telling me a fact? Yes, I got that job. I went for the interview, and now, mom can afford all those things we couldn't afford before. Thank God. And now, we won't have to trek to school again because we are getting a new car. Oh, thank you, God. Also, we will be getting a new house in the rich people area. Wow! Wait, mom. Are we in April? So I will know if you are pranking me. Is it April Fool's Day? No, Adrian. It's not. I am for real. So you mean we are leaving this dark site very soon? That means no more lonely and grim rallies any time I am coming back from school. Yes! I am so glad. So when are we moving, Mom? This is your office. If there's any furniture you would like to be moved or changed to your taste, please do not hesitate to let me know. No, Mr. Patrick. The office is just perfect. All right. Take your time and get acquainted to our departments. Mode of operation, staffs, and ask questions as you wish. You report directly to me. So if you need anything, let me know. Thank you, sir. And before I forget, your car is here at the garage with all its papers completely done. So at the close of work, it will be officially handed over to you, and we will take you to your house as well. All right, sir. Thank you so much. Welcome to the team. This feels so wonderful. I can't believe this is actually real. I can't wait to boss others around. I have been bossed around for so long that it feels like I was born to be bossed around. Now I hold the mace. This is our new house, Adrian. It's a dream come true. Congratulations to us, Mum. The couch is very soft, Mum. It feels lovely. That's not all. Your room bed is also very soft, my son. Letty will really love this. Yes, come in. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. I want to know if my application for a two days leave have been granted. I submitted it three weeks ago. I saw it the day you submitted it. I am sorry it won't be granted as you requested. I will only give you a day. We have a lot to do this period. But ma'am, it's so important. Taking one day will not suffice. Well, that's my decision. Find a way around it. If you don't have anything else to say, please call me Arthur. Good day, ma'am. Pamela said you called for me. Yes, I wanted you to give me a breakdown of everyone's leave timetable. I don't want anyone taking me unaware. Okay, ma'am. We'll email them to you. So tell me, Patrick, how is the office? Have we come out of the negative growth curve? We are still working on it, sir. With the new road map we rolled out, we'll be out of the danger zone in three months' time. Well, that's one good news for the day. How about Mrs. Christabel? How has her performance been? She has settled down very well with the company's process. I conducted a random survey with the staffs in the office, trying to know what her reputation is with them. And what did you find out? I found out that they didn't like her at all. Why is that? They said she was inconsiderate and bossy as well. I see. You know we need people with empathy. Empathy is not thought in school. But then, maybe she has her reasons for being strict. You have a point, sir. Let's hope it's just her establishing authority. Give her more task to see how she performs. I will, sir. We'll assign recruitment to her. That's a great idea, Patrick. Good morning, Mrs. Christabel. Good morning, Mr. Patrick. How are you doing today, sir? Very well. I came around your office, but you were not there. Yes, sir. We just rounded up a departmental meeting at the conference room. Okay. I came to tell you that our recruitment time is upon us, and we would like you to handle it this time. All right, sir. I will. There will be some incentives to it for you. Thank you, sir, for the opportunity.